Check this out. Morgan Freeman, Robert De Niro, and now Jeremy Renner. Incredible what this young actress has achieved for herself. She was raised in Winder, Georgia. She was Miss Georgia USA. And now, seven years later after winning this title, she's out in Hollywood with a brand new film called Kill the Messenger. We asked her first and foremost when she was on my radio show, how do you handle rejection? Oh, just gonna jump right to it. Um, you know, I think I'm just a naturally positive person. So, uh, you know, I get rejected almost every day in my line of work. So I just have to keep on doing it. Just well, you've got a big role coming up. Tell us about the new movie and particularly the star you get to act alongside. Woohoo! I'm in Kill the Messenger. It comes out October 10th in theaters. Um, I play the girlfriend of one of the other characters, played by Robert Patrick. And Robert Patrick is this drug lord guy, and I'm his little sidekick girlfriend. Was it fun? It was so fun. Was it fun playing a bad girl, or is it natural? Uh, <laughs> no, it's fun. Every job I take is also all... They're all fun. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, we got to work in Atlanta. We actually filmed in Marietta at this beautiful house, which is supposed to be set, I think, somewhere in California. Um, but yeah, I, got to, I have a scene with Jeremy Renner, and I'm actually in the first like opening scenes of the film. That's fantastic. It has some talk of Oscar buzz. What do you think it is about this story that's going to capture people? I think it's a story that not a lot of people are aware of because it happened, you know, sort of almost before my time. It happened, well, it happened in the early 90s. That was when I was growing up. Um, <laughs> but, you know, I think Jeremy Renner just has a really profound role in it, and his acting is unbelievable. They're saying it's going to be, like, his best project yet since Hurt Locker, so. What will you remember most about the experience of acting along with him in this movie? Well, I think my most memorable part, I got one of my scenes is in, I'm in a swimming pool and I'm swimming while they're doing a walk and talk scene with Jeremy and Robert Patrick. And I just had to, that day the pool was so freezing and I had to I just swim back and forth, back and forth, like so many times. I got a, a good workout in that day. And at the very end of the day, I was really wet and I had to, t I wanted to take a picture with Jeremy because obviously he's amazing. And I'm so just wet and I have like makeup running down my face, but I got a great picture with him. That's <laughs> awesome. Jenna, tell us about the pageant of hope that you started back in the day when you were in pageants. I founded my own nonprofit called Pageant of Hope. Well, it's called HBBQ's Inc. stands for Has Been Beauty Queens. But we put on events called Pageants of Hope all over the world. It's a pageant for kids who wouldn't normally compete in pageants, kids with disabilities, challenges. Initially started as a cancer pageant, but we've since branched out. But we do their hair, we do their makeup, we teach them the pageant walk. And at the end of the day, we crown every participant winners. That's wonderful. What have these young kids taught you? They... Well, they bring me so much light, and they just taught me that my problems are way smaller compared to what these kids are facing, especially the ones facing, you know, terminally ill diseases. That's wonderful. And you go back to Hollywood. We're <laughs> grateful that you came to Georgia. What's next? What's next? I begin, I'm supposed to film a horror film next month in October, um, and then also I'm kind of in the talks right now to film another thriller actually in China next month as well. So I should have a really busy October. That's wonderful. Thanks for visiting with us. Thanks for having me. Certainly sound advice. Jenna Sims. Jenna Sims. That's a name you've got to remember. We're going to see a lot more from her in Hollywood and congratulate her on her latest film, Kill the Messenger. We'll be right back with more Get Connected.